Now, of course, it, is, it has been a shock that it happened with Chelsea. Uh, is it a shock, really? No, it is, because, you know, you, I think he'd done extremely well with Chelsea. Uh, of course, the politics in the club. You never know, you know, what the, what the truth is about all the politics and what's happening behind the scenes. Therefore, um, it, it, it's always a shock when a, when a coach who has been successful has been, you know, been sacked. It happened also with me. It's strange. When you're successful at Chelsea, then they sack you. If you're not, you know, you can stay for six or seven what years. What happens? How do you feel when they, I mean, do they sort of call you in? Or do they yeah. ring you in the morning over breakfast it's, and say, come and have a chat? Or how's it work? Yeah. It's not a nice when you... Okay, if you are a coach, the only thing you know for certain that you get sacked. You know that after a while. Um, it depends only on the circumstances how it happens. Um, if you if you uh, want to improve your position, then everybody thinks you are you know you're not good enough, and everybody everybody attacks you. But when you get sacked, everything is you know it's a, it's a different situation, and you never you never feel comfortable with it. It's not a nice feeling, but you know you get over it. To what extent should players accept some responsibility for the way the team's playing, though, and not just fall on the shoulders of the coach? They do, but it's easier to sack the coach than to sack all the players. You know, That's not fair, is it? It, Yeah, but that is, that is easier. You know, you have so many players, you have now uh, squads of 22, can't sack six or five players. Mm -hmm. And of course, uh, to a certain extent, you know, the, the, the coach is, is responsible for it. And he takes his responsibility also. And if you take the job, you know that that, is, that can happen. So it's part of, you know... But he had brought them quite a lot of silverware in a very short period of time. I know, that's why... Would you why. not say it's quite harsh that they got rid of him? Yeah, but I already said, you don't know what happened behind the scenes. You don't know what the politics of the club is. And therefore... Uh, is it a political club? Did you find that? Every, t every club. It's not so much what happens on the pitch, but it's also what happens behind you. People who are, you know, involved in the club, what their ideas are uh, for, 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 to be successful and sometimes they have also their own friends they want to bring in it's all political and that can be more dangerous than the players on the pitch